I really don't go by anything, so you could say I'm gay because I strictly like women, I don't like boys. Two out of five youth are scared to come out in that school because they are gay, lesbian, bisexual, transgender, or questioning. I identify as gay. Bisexual. I am a, a lesbian. So I became very depressed and so much so that my mother eventually realized um, that I was really depressed. I, I stopped eating, I couldn't sleep, so I underwent psychiatric evaluation for a little while, went into counseling. With my counselor, I told my, my counselor was the first person that I told officially that I was gay. And then through counseling, I like, after a two week process of counseling, I was able to bring my mother in and say, okay, mom, this is the reason that I've been so depressed. This is why I wanted to go into counseling is because I am homosexual. Did you know that 25% of teenagers are thrown out of their homes when they come out to their family members? My, my mother not accepting it, her being a Christian and not believing in it, and her not, like, don't want to deal with it. Like, what, how, like, what did, she, did she say anything negative to you about that uh, choice? I'm good. Um, she, when, she, when I first told her, I told her I had anger. When I told her, like... She was mad at you? Yeah. She didn't believe it. The, like the next week, I got put out. Ooh, I think I was in like sixth grade or something, and I was crushing on a girl, and I didn't understand back then. So it was like I didn't try it. I didn't try to talk to her or anything. But as time went on, it like came out even more because I've been a tomboy and I've been playing basketball for a long time. So it just came out. Actually, my friends was telling me instead of me telling them, and then that's when I started explaining to them. I came to it myself. Many Chicago public school students have different opinions toward the LGBT community. Some of them are negative and some of them are positive. If they're a girl, I don't have no type of problem with that. But if they're a dude, it's kind of some type of problem with that. Why? Because I'm a dude and two dudes should not be poking at each other. I know. Studs, dykes, and faggots. That's what they want, then they should. If a dude want to go with another dude, he can go with him. Just don't say nothing to me. 40% of students between the ages of 16 and 18 say that they were prejudged against homosexuals. Because it's just the whole purpose. Like, they got the same thing I got, and they trying to, I don't like that. If you gay, you gay. It shouldn't really matter. And you can't judge people based on their preferences. I think everyone is entitled to live life the way that they choose. Um, and if you think differently than that, then you're entitled to that opinion and so are other people, so. To me, I cannot judge a person's lifestyle. I am not God. Um, whatever a person chooses to do with their life, that's them. God got the final say so at the end of the day. That's just my personal opinion. Some youth are scared to tell their parents about their sexual orientation because they are afraid of their reaction. Accepting sexuality at any sta stage of life that is different from the normal, normal being heterosexual, it's going to be tough. And they don't, no parent wants to see their child in a difficult position. One parent has some advice for the youth that are afraid to tell their parents. If that's something that you're dealing with, don't be afraid to go and speak. Talk to somebody about it. See how they'll take it, because you'll never know. They might actually accept it. But if they don't, you know, just try to work things out. Uh, keep in mind that you're not alone. Um, I think that was one of the biggest things that I needed someone to say to me when I was coming of age. If they love them, they should love them no matter what they choose to be or what they do with their life. This is my child, and I love her no matter what her preference is and what she chooses. LGBT rights are important because they are human. They are still the same, and also they're just like us. They get treated different because of their lifestyles, but people don't realize it's not a lifestyle, it's their life.